right, so motivation might be tough for a lot of people on today because we just lost an hour, right? Yes. So it's good to keep your mental health in check all the time. What are some mm -hmm. ways we can do that? Definitely some ways you can do that is checking in with yourself each morning, setting appropriate time each morning to check in with yourself, asking yourself, how am I feeling today? You know, developing some great mantras in the morning time, like today is gonna be a great day, even though it's Monday, because typically people like, I hate Mondays, but it's what are you saying in your mind? What are you saying to yourself? What is that inner critic saying? You know, am I gonna have a good day today? Am I anticipating a good day? So developing a good routine in the morning time as well, self-reflection, like when you get ready to get up, do some self-reflection on, how do I feel this morning? What do I anticipate? And then when you get in back home, do also do some journaling to check in with yourself because that, those are some good practical guides that you can use in order to check in with your body, check in with your thoughts. Also, what kind of challenges did I have today? Did I make some good choices or some negative choices? What could I do differently the next day? So when you think about journaling, because some folks get started, you know, it kind of t sends trendy in a way yeah. for some people but yeah. then what happens when we get past the point of the trend when we get tired at night and you're thinking yes i do need to journal but it's 8 30 and i'm ready to go to sleep well you know what i i do recommend that you do your voice recorder you absolutely can do that you know a lot of times my clients say i really just don't feel like journaling when i get home because i've had a long day well technology get your your phone out and record it and you can go back and then make manuscripts from that. Okay, so now you also have some things that you've done. Mm -hmm. What is the book all about? My book is about developing a better mindset through mental health and having that Christian perspective. It's basically, when you look at mental health, it's a lifestyle. So it's not just about one particular thing. It's all about the mind, the body, and the spirit. So we're looking at what are you thinking? What, what am I feeling in my body? And how am I taking care of myself? Because it's a lifestyle change. And then you can integrate your faith in that through meditation, through prayer, uh, journaling, exercising, developing some routines in your life. So you can use the book as a guide. And we have the journaling uh, prompts to go with that as well for each chapter. All right, I love that. And yeah. it, it helps to really keep yourself together. Because Absolutely. right now, a lot of folks are not as together as Absolutely. we'd like to be. Yes. All right, and how can we contact you to find out about you your services? Contact me at ggivesconsulting.com. And I'm also on Instagram and Facebook on a ggivesconsulting.